Good afternoon YouTube viewers and subscribers. So on the stand today I've got this OS FS48 Surpass engine that um, was basically a blown up engine and I repaired the crankcase. This is the first time I'm going to run it on video. I did just actually fire it up in the garage real quick. Um, so I'm going to do this one on video here. It's going to be a very short run. It's still kind of warm. It clearly has bad bearings, but it does run and it runs pretty well. All I really did was adjust the high speed needle a bit. Turns out that, as usual, I don't always use my brain a whole lot. <clears throat> and a buddy of mine had all the parts for this engine. Um, all I needed to do was call him and he was going to give them to me. So, unfortunately, I've invested a you know, bit of money into this engine when I could have gotten them for a lot less uh, from him. The good news is he's got connecting rods. Uh, for this engine so once this run is done I'm probably going to disassemble it and send the connecting rod from this engine to him so he can match up one that he's got and then maybe he'll send me some bearings also and we'll get this thing all straightened out properly uh, but anyway this is going to be a quick short run of this engine a Zor 12.6 prop some S&W 5% fuel and an OSF plug so let's uh, fire it up and see how she does Prime it again here.
Okay, so as you can see, it runs like I said it would. It runs all right. Uh, like I said, what I'm going to do now is probably just go inside, completely disassemble this engine in preparation for the new crankcase, take this connecting rod off, send it to my buddy so that he can uh, find a replacement one in his bin. And then hopefully this engine will be basically like new in about another week or two. But uh, as you can see, it looks like that uh, case uh, JB Weld held, did fine, the engine runs well, and that's all she wrote for this. So thank you for watching.